my name is Beth Hiley here for Board Game Geek at Gen Con 50. I'm sitting down with Andy Looney of Looney Labs, and you brought us Mad Libs Adult Mad Libs. <laughs> That's right. Now, of course, you all know Mad Libs. It's been around forever as the thing where you write in uh, words on a tablet. But uh, we were approached by Mad Libs a couple years ago about making a game based on Mad Libs. And last year, we brought out the original Mad Libs, the game, which was very family friendly. But people like little edgier things. So <laughs> through our adult imprint, Fully Baked Ideas, we have brought out the adult version of Mad Libs. Now, that said, it's still it's racy and and innuendo laden, but it's, it, but indeed, but as we say right on the box there, it's tasteful adult fun. No politics and no put downs. So we're trying not to be too rude or offensive or terrible with our game, but it is gonna be uh, not for kids because things get pretty racy. Now the way this works <laughs> is that you'll have these word cards and each one like we see here for bid, this, we've got all the different possible like adverb or adjective, noun or verb, whatever, spelled out. So one base word for bid can be a verb as forbid or forbidden, or forbidder, one forbidder. who forbids, <laughs> forbiddenly. Um, and so you'll have a story card. So uh, I'm sorry, Mr. Party, I couldn't stop verbing my now. <laughs> <laughs> so each of us is going to have a hand of seven cards. And these are going to be word cards like that one there. And take a look at your cards. Right. We're each going to take do our own version of this. Okay. So, look at your ones. And in uh, in regular Mad Libs, of course, it's just utterly random, and the, the the wackiness often results from things not fitting at all. Here, it's still pretty random because it's these five words or seven <laughs> words. But we get to choose the way to make them optimally funny. So, I okay, am. Ready. Uh, and I haven't. I haven't. Like staged this at all, <laughs> so I don't know if I've that got a good set. That makes it all the better. <laughs> uh, uh. Oh wait, no, I think I'll do this. I. We're doing this for real. We are, okay. Yeah, yeah. So, I don't know what I got. If it's a mind's any good, you're probably going to win. So, what is your answer to this question? Okay. I'm sorry I missed the party. I couldn't stop pickling my hand. <laughs> so, that's a good choice. I'm sorry I missed the party. I, I couldn't stop squishing my hair. <laughs> I don't know. So, the way we'd work, is we'd all do our ones, and then you'd vote for the one you think is the funniest. You can't vote for yourself. So we wouldn't really be able to play two-player because we each just right. vote for our, ourselves. <laughs> but one of the things that's fun is that you can have people who aren't actually in the game vote at this stage. <laughs> so as a party game, you can bring in everybody to say, which was funniest? So I uh, leave it to the viewers. Which was funniest? I, 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 I think it was you. I think the people's <laughs> hand was funnier. So let's say you got the vote. You would then keep this in front of you. You have uh, one point. Get one point. You get, when you get three points, you win. It's as simple as that. And just to give a few examples of the cards, we got like taste, massive, cheek, cry, ball, distract, noodles, nuts, Love, itch, babe. tattoo. I can see what you mean. Like they're a little cheeky, but they're not. Buzz. Yeah, exactly. Not, oh, crazy. But you know, you got hole and, and you're your incredible hole. Strip, that's there. <laughs> Endless. That that's has slobber. <laughs> Endless slobber. That naughty. Uh, lick. <laughs> well, yeah, okay, there we go. <laughs> and I, sh I should point out, um, Jeremy Holcomb, a game designer friend of mine, and some of his students actually did all the work on writing up all the, the story word stories and words for this particular version. I did the original and then uh, I, I felt you know, I I can let other people build out the design on this one, so I can't take all the uh, all the credit for the comedy on this one, so thanks to them for that. Well, if you guys want to check that out and have a fabulous time, as we just have, because that was not feigned at all, we did we did that turn for reals. That's right. Uh, that is Adult Mad Libs, which is from Looney Labs, and Andrew, Andrew, thank you again. Thanks for playing my games.